everybody. I hope you've had a great Monday. This is Brittany Fry and it is day 13 of March Madness and we're still going strong. So tonight I got to go to a really great event and it reminded me of a couple of things. The first thing is, is how lucky I am to be a realtor. When I was in college, I invested 110% of my time into an animal shelter that I worked at and volunteered at. And it completed a huge part of my heart that I was able to give back to my community and help all these precious little animals and help them find homes, whether it was locally or sending them to a rescue group. But either way, it was a huge part of me. So when I left that chapter in my life, there was such a big gap and I found myself not being able to feel like any job was enough or that I was doing something good. So by having this job as a real estate agent, one, I get to feel like I'm doing something good every day because I'm helping people in my community, whether it's buying or listing homes. I get to help them find that perfect fit for their family or make sure that they can sell their property so they can move on to their next chapter. And that makes me so happy. But additionally, I actually get to do a couple of other things within my community as well. The first thing is that I'm involved with my Chamber of Commerce, and to me that's really important when you are a part of a small business or your own business to be a part of your Chamber so that way you have so many professional connections and you get to appreciate all the other local businesses within the area so we support one another, which is awesome. And the other thing is, is I actually get to do a lot on base. So as most of you know, I'm a military spouse and I get to help other spouses and make sure that they're getting through their deployments okay and just that life is going fine. And to me, that's so important to be that person that somebody can call and just say, hey, I need somebody right now. Or, hey, could you, do you think you could just make me dinner tonight? You know, And that's okay. And I love that because I'm getting to give back and help somebody out. So tonight, the other thing that I was reminded of is that as much as I want to give back to Sumter, Sumter gives back to all of us a lot. So this evening we were talking about getting ready for deployments and all the things that happen on the military member side and at home with the family. So the whole point was though, every person that spoke, I, I listened to 10, maybe 15 different speakers tonight, and every single one of them had the same exact message. If you need me, I'm here. It doesn't matter what time of the day. It doesn't matter if it's the weekend. It doesn't matter if you're calling me when it's not business hours, I'm here. And that's so important for people to know that there's places for you to go. There's actually so many events within this community, whether it's on base or off base. And there's so much to appreciate and so many people that care about you. So I thought about all the different events that I've been to, even off base, whether it was with the chamber or with my job. And everywhere I go, people appreciate you so much. And they just always tend to say, if there's anything I can do to help, let me know. And I think it's so important for us to realize that. So many times if one negative thing happens, we focus on the negative. And I did that for a very long time, especially when I moved to the Sumter community. I had one bad experience and it was really hard for me to see the positive in Sumter. And now that I am a part of the positive, I realized that it was truly around me the whole time. Everywhere I went, there was great things to see and do and people that wanted to help and were there for me. I just didn't take them up on their offer. So I'm here to tell you, Make sure you are staying in contact with all of these great people that actually want to be a part of your life and want to help you and get involved in all of the events that are going on around town. There are a ton of them locally and I'll continue to talk about them as I hear or see what's going on. But either way, I hope you guys have a great night and a great rest of the week and I'll talk to you soon.